welcome to Creative Cooking in Ani's Kitchen. Oh, My name is Ani, and today I'm going to bring you, uh, I'm going to try a, a cheesy croissant bread loaf, um, actually two. I've got five cups of flour and a teaspoon of salt, which I'm going to mix in right away with the flour. Okay, get that out the way. Already making a mess with the flour. Okay, and uh, you're going to want one cup of warm milk and one cup of warm water. Uh, what I do is I just get the two cups together, you know, the one cup of each, and I put it in the microwave for a minute and let it sit. Um, you're going to have a tablespoon of yeast, one third cup of oil. You're going to want um, either vegetable oil or grapeseed oil, canola oil. Do not use extra virgin olive oil or olive oil, okay? Uh, you're going to need two tablespoons of sugar. You're going to need one egg yolk with one tablespoon of milk. I used heavy whipping cream and I had to beat that together. One stick of butter melted and one cup of cheddar cheese, white cheddar usually works. I got a little mix here of shredded cheese, finely shredded cheese, okay? And that's gonna be the ingredients to get this dough together. Okay, so I've got my sand mixer here. Let's go ahead and plug this in. mixing and then the dough hook is good for kneading okay so we we'll use the paddle first and first thing we're going to do is put in our warm liquids one cup of milk one cup of water warm both of them i use dvap by the way we're going to put in our sugar, two tablespoons of sugar, okay? We're going to put in our oil, one third cup of oil. I got grapeseed oil, okay? And we're going to mix this a little bit on one. Get that combo going. Okay, just for a few seconds. Then we're going to drop in our yeasty beasties. One tablespoon. Okay. And we're going to give this a good mix. Okay. On speed one. For a couple of minutes. Make sure that sugar and the yeasty pieces, the milk, the oil, all gets in there and cook it. Alright? Everybody is cool. Sorry about the noise, I have company. And which is why I'm making this bread for my company so they can take with them. And, uh, so yeah, so I decided to videotape it. I do have this recipe on my old channel, on the other channel, um, as croissants. But right now I'm going to try it as a loaf. See how that works out. And I'm using my triple loaf pan, but I only probably have enough for two loaves. Because it's five cups of flour. Alright, so we've got this mixed in there really well. So now what we're going to do is we're going to let it rest. Okay. Just going to take this off. Okay. I'm going to 
Cover it up. Cover that up and we're going to leave it for 10 minutes. So I'm going to set the time for 10 minutes. Preheat your oven to 350. 10 minutes. I'll be back. Okay, time's up. We're going to check on our yeasty beasties here. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Okay. Are they alive? Let's see. He's alive. Look at them. <laughs> They're good. So now we're gonna add in our flour. Okay? It's five cups, remember. All right, so here we go. So mix it in there. that in there so it doesn't fly everywhere when we mix it. Let me turn this stand mix on. Okay. Alright. I'm going to wipe my fingers. Guess what? Paddle back on. Yep, and we're gonna mix for five minutes with the paddle because the paddle is for mixing. And we still need to mix all these ingredients together. If I can get it on. There we go. Okay. So and we go. Lock, start off on one. Okay, so I did the five minutes with the uh, paddle, and now I've got it uh, with the uh, dough hook. So I'm going to go ahead and do that for about 10 minutes. I actually have this on a number two, and I'm going to do it number four. Okay, so I'm going to go for about 10 minutes, and I'll bring you back. Okay, I'm going to stop this. Very sticky dough. We're going to let it uh, proof right in the bowl. Everything you can off the side. And down with this. Mama, there's nothing you can do, Mama. What? As far as putting it away. Do what? As far as putting the grocery away. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to take them out if she puts them away. 
Oh, okay. Okay? Okay, Mama. Um, I want you to get out of breath. Oh, got a new favorite. No, we're going to take it back because we got this one working. I found a little metal screw. Oh. And I put it back and David pushed it, it in. Now? Yeah. That's what I was trying to tell you for you on your phone. Okay, so we're going to give a um, three. Three. Yeah, we're going to put a little bit of oil in there. And we're going to go ahead and let this through. Right there where it sits. Okay. It'll be fine. Just like that. Cover it up. One hour. Be back. What's coming? That was over here. Is David? So she can put me David? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Hi. All right, guys. So this is risen. I deflated it. Now we're going to go ahead and proceed with the next step. What are you guys going to do? Okay. Turn this out. Comes out. Yes, I have a scale. That I never use one. Okay. He said he was painting all of the unpacked boxes around the So I put them all so. every day. I would bring one down and empty it. Fold the first one. Look at that go. Look how beautiful. See that? Okay. So many things each day are pleasing me. I don't even notice. You to keep it over here. You have to cover it up. Okay. So it doesn't dry out on us. Then we're going to work with this one. Okay? You know, I've been working a long late night the past few months. This project I've been involved with. I'm so. Okay. Yeah. Once I'm done. The back room and the stick. I'll be home in time for dinner. Every night. You can't, doesn't have to be perfect. Get this out the way. Okay, so now that we got it, I 
I'm sure Brad is very pleased. You want to take the butter? Trust me, I'm sucking up like crazy. And if I make a good impression, his parents might buy us a house. A house? As a wedding gift. Darling, we really need to rethink this one too. They're farmed on millions of gallons of oil. So whatever you think of them, be nice. I'm always This is a quick version. Not fishing nice. Time for some? Don't pick up. We're late. Don't worry. We bought one of those newfangled machines that takes a message. You know, I, don't know how I was going to make it cheesy, but I'm kind of second thinking it. Maybe just make it plain buttery croissant. This is a test. Bernie, it's not a good time. I've never done it before as a loaf. I've always done it just in croissant size, you know? Right before my wedding? Then we're going to take it. We want to fold it. They think I was raised by a woman who's never had a marriage that longer than a pregnant. You're blaming me after three husbands. Yes. What's your excuse this time? Okay. It's a charming story. Yeah, yes. Well, we, we both have charming stories, but I, I don't want to bore you with a lot of what we Brits call them. I'm going to brush some up here. Oh, Got some butter. Fine. Let's just All right, we've got our first one. I'm going to set that to the side. I really need my face scraper. Okay. Good morning. Put that to the side. Next. My husband and I just moved Red number two. butter. <laughs> Don't you just love it? What's up?
pinch, pinch, pinch all the seams in. Okay, I'll put the, almost knocked my rolling pin on the first one into the bread bin. Just to show you, there's the first one in. Now for the second one. All those layers is what you want because you want it real fluffy and soft inside, so airy. Okay, so cheese. Spread that out. Okay. Put as little or as much as you want, totally on you. Fold it up. Where's the plastic? Okay. Okay, we want to pinch, pinch, pinch where the seam is. Get a lot of the air out that way. Okay. Okay. We're going to let rise. Let this rise for 30 minutes. And then it'll be time to bake. I'll bring you back. Alright guys, I'm over here slicing yep. the bread. I'm talking to my yep. subscribers, Mama. Okay. <laughs> Mama thought I was talking to her. Because Hopster's asleep, so it's just her and I awake right now. We just got in from the pool. Had a nice 20 laps. Just had to do my exercise try to stay healthy for the transplant should it come I'd be ready you know gotta do your part all right so I've done scored the bread and a 350 degree oven, as I told you when we started, to heat up your oven. We're going to put these puppies in. Okay. So, put it right in there. And she's already at 350. So, we're going to do. 35 minutes and we'll check her then okay we'll do a little egg wash actually you know what I think I, no I don't want it to brown just right now 
We'll do a little egg wash after 30 minutes, 35 minutes, and then we'll put it back in for a few more. Okay? Be back. All right, so here we have it. We did 40 minutes in the oven. After 30 minutes, I'll put the egg wash on it. And there she is. So we're getting ready to dump her out onto the cooling rack so they don't collapse from condensation. All right. Now when they cool off, just to be clear, I still think we should. Uh, we'll bag them up so they get nice and soft. But just because I can't have you as a husband doesn't mean I can't have you as a friend. Okay, so I'm gonna I dump them over here. Happy. Uh, came right out. Here they are. Hot, hot, hot. On the cooling rack. Oh yeah, they're soft. They're gonna be real soft. It's very hot. Hello. All right. Hello. We'll let them cool down and uh, then we'll slice them up. Oh, sorry. I just look how nice. Two look how nice they look. Oh yeah. This is gonna be very very. See, look how soft. You see that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I get so excited. Don't forget, it's cheesy croissant loaf. So, I'll be back when we get ready to cut it. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and Perhaps one day you'll give me one. Cut it to this. Sorry about the noise. You have a very interesting marriage. Okay. Still very hot. So just a little piece. Um, what are you talking about? Our visit was cut short yesterday, so I just thought. Oh, yeah, she's very soft. Do you want me to have a for you? Oh, no, no. I just. Yeah, we'll ask her. Sit. Sit. I'll get them for you. You don't have to do that. It's no trouble. Besides, I have some good news. Look at that. That's nice. Let's use some. I found you a man. So soft. Elden soft. It bounces Elden back. Ratzinger. And when it cools off, nice. it's even yeah, better. I'm going to go ahead and brush on flats. some butter. Thanks. Even though but it's already very buttery. I've been anyone for a while. Won't forget about Rob. Okay, the there's the butter. Trust me, I won't be forgetting about Rob anytime soon. And I'm going to take a bite. you got to get over this obsession with another woman's husband. You're going to end up angry mm -hmm. and sad. Mm -hmm. You are right about that. This is so good, y'all. You, you have no idea. You know, flowers aren't the only thing. Make yourself some. What are you talking about? So after these cool off, I'll put I'm these pregnant. in a bag, a plastic bag. Um, sure. Saran wrap hurt? it. And then a bag. Yes, yes I am. I'll get you a bandage. So they'll get completely soft. Uh, every student needs for so good. is confidence. At well, CPS, we have it in all shapes, sizes, and forms. Like deep scrub, extra hold, antibacterial, college hold, mm -hmm. and spearmint, to name just a few. Look. See that? Soft. Softness. See it? The great school. And the is back. That's what you want. It's still very, very hot. So it'll be even better once it cools off. Until the next one, though, you all give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Go ahead and make yourself a thumbs up. a quick version to a croissant a type of dough. Okay, in preparation. Uh, but I just made a loaf out of it. I made two loaves out of it instead of the individual croissant pieces, which would have been rolled up. Kind of like this was. Which I have a video on my old channel. It's called uh, Cheesy Croissant Rolls. Go ahead and check that out. And that way, you, if you want to make that instead, you can. But this is the same recipe.
okay? Just a different result, okay? Decided to make the loaves instead of the individual loaves. So go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Smash that subscribe button. Turn on that notification bell. Ding, ding. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a new recipe. Until the next one, you all, you take care, okay? God bless. Take care of yourselves and one another. Bye.